Cameraman, you need to know your role. Shut your mouth. I know I just stole that from one of the worst wrestlers ever. But whatever, we're here on WAW Aftermath. I, of course, am greatness himself. Chad Epic sitting next to the Celtic Relic, Matt Bishop. And you know what? I, I got so much to say, but there's a special surprise we have in the ring, so you know what to say, Mr. Bishop. I do indeed, and before I do, I just want to put out a very happy, very good happy birthday wish to my friend Car 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 <laughs> Camarilla. Happy birthday, love. Love you much, baby. And then that, and it is for you and you only that I'm going to say, let's take it to dealer. Thank you. Y'all need a 20-minute intro? Always. I don't think so. Always. How y'all doing tonight? Hey, Betty, you make some noise. Of course, I'm Dirty Dealer. You may be asking yourself where Peter Labrie is tonight. Tonight in, uh, in Nova Scotia, there was a James Bond fanatic singles party. And Peter Labrie is quite popular with those three illegitimate babies from Peter Labrie. Maybe more. The man's a jackhammer. So he has the night off. He's in Nova Scotia. Dirty Dealer's here. Before we start, I want to let y'all know next week's our anniversary show. It's a free show. So tell your friends to tell their friends to tell their mamas, their grandmas, I don't care, tell a cousin. Go find some bums, bring them here, I don't care, it's free. Just don't, as long as they haven't soiled themselves, they can come on in. So let's get the show on the road. One week away till our anniversary show, I'm the Dirty Dealer. We're going to bring out the sexual Tyrannosaurus, the tall man, the sexy man, the long haired man, JC himself, Buck to Russ. You just start your countdown, and old Bucky will be back here before you can say, Blast off! A James Bond single convention. Yes! Alright, stranger things have happened, however, we have the sexual Tyrannosaurus, Mr. Buster Ross, starting off the show tonight, of course, two weeks out from. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What the? Oh! Oh, come on! That was the red mist right into. What is this? Oh, dear God in heaven. I don't think God or heaven has anything to do with this. No, the three Hall of Shamers out oh, here. Oh, come on. Oh, please. I'm sorry. What has Gino done since he's got since he came back, huh? Still oh, a we're better shamer. than you. What's Chris Shady done since Gene, Gino came back and got him? We're better than you. And Rocco, Rocco, I am seriously, he is lucky I am behind this commentating table. Really? I am You're, ready. Uh, no, I would take this chair and crack it over that melon head of his for what he did to Stalina at Hellbound. I'll Give make sure to tell break. him that you said that. Yeah, right, go right ahead. Good crap. <laughs> Not me. I don't know who let him in. I have nothing to do with it, but that was funny. I enjoy Buck Ross getting beat up. Turn the, damn the, mic on. the mic is on. You need to push the button. Yeah, push the button. And it turns green. Yeah, turn it green. Hey, this, there there we we go. Go. These idiots don't know how to run things. I don't know how to run things, and they're the ones that can't yeah. get the mics working. You can't silence us. <laughs> get to the you back trying to get us hurt? What? You trying to get us hurt? You hurt, oh, maybe. Fuck you. Tonight, we let you know who we are. We are the uh, three kings. Three queens. And we are better than all of you. Shut your mouth. We are not queens. I love the food. It looks beautiful. And the reason darling. we are formed You're is because of the greenhorns downstairs. They walk around here like they run this place. But the thing is, these three guys right here, us, we built this house. Mm -hmm. We made WAW what it is. Not. Yeah. Shut up, Dave Dallas. And you listen to him. He speaks the truth. The truth. <laughs> you can't handle the truth. We are better than the truth. Shut up, you little tomboy. It's people like you. Those greenhorns downstairs have the attitude like you. Like their shit don't stink and like they're better than everybody else. If it wasn't for us, there would be no WAW. We are the Hall of Famers. We are the Free Kings. And we are better than every single one of you, everybody downstairs, the cameraman, and those shitty commentary people. Hey. Yeah. More, more, more Bishop than you. Yeah, come on. I'll agree but with you that. you need to learn your place around here, too. What is it about 
My place is right here. Yeah, stay there where you belong. Don't get in this ring. <laughs> We're sick of being overshadowed and nobody looking at us. Talking about being overshadowed and having them trying to forget us. I, you go to the, you go to the www.wrestling.com, all right? And go to the Hall of Fame. You look up Gino Diamini. Uh -huh. What do you get? You get a broken link. Oh, I am the first ever Hall of Famer. I'm a seven time WWE champion. I am the Apocalypse King. And I am a broken link on the website. Are you kidding? This means. Oh, that's like a broken record. <laughs> oh, this is going to feel good. Oh. I've been waiting for so long to tell you stupid, smelly ass fans what I feel about you. I think, I think it's important that you're a juggalo that you must smell like shit. Oh, the jugglers? They're below everybody. We all know that. We're, you guys cheer me on when I beat the crap out of Alex Chase with weapons. But where are you when I'm bleeding? Huh? Where are you when I had my shoulder separated? Where were you in the emergency room? You were nowhere but cheering those three doors on! <laughs> and let's talk about that little slut, Selena. Whoa, hang on, Straco. Oh, yeah. She's a See, slut. I was smart. I used her for what I want, and we all know what I wanted. <laughs> Kick it in the curb. She just needs to get a little common sense and stop calling me because this means we're better than you! Well, I can think of one person they are not better than and that is this man coming up the stairs right now! The war machine! I really have no idea what's Don't going get on any tonight. Courage, then. Do not get any courage, okay? We'll beat you down like I beat you down uh -oh. at Hellbound. Oh! Oh, oh you storm mean? What's that? The storm machine sit! Storm machine. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, uh, there's also there's also boar machine, there's whore machine. If you're so much better than everybody, why don't you come up with something original that ain't been used about 88 times to describe me? <laughs> I've used a few of those. You want to talk about? Yeah, you look where it got you. Shut your mouth. I've been here just as long as you have, and I've been longer. I've been here longer than the two of you. So shut your mouth. You talk about respect. You show some. But I was the first Hall of Famer. Oh, I'm you were the first Hall of Famer. Champion. Good for you. You be your trick or treat. Thank you. The three princesses. <laughs> uh, the three princesses. You're just jealous, that, jealous that we have one fight. In any event, in Hellbound, you talk about Hellbound, where you beat me. Oh, I do believe you had to have some assistance from Chris Shady. No, I didn't. I didn't think oh. Chris Shady. Do you guys remember Chris Shady coming out here and I knocked him I on his head? Shady. I didn't see so Shady. You proved nothing other than you need help from your boyfriend to get the job done. <laughs> Marco! Out of the two, out of the really, three of you! Really gay I jokes? Think, really thin gay jokes? Damn. Yeah, really, gay jokes. Out of the three of you, I'd expect this from these two. Out of you? Hell about 2009. You talk about trick or treat? Oh God. That was it, yeah, you did beat me. And that was the night you earned my respect. Two years later is the night that you lost my respect. Alex Chase is out here. Say, you say whatever you will about Alex Chase, but he's one of my good friends. And he paid you respect when he didn't need to pay you any respect. He offered his hand. 
I hate him for his hand. He, he set paths here in WWE. He revolutionized, revolutionized the pure division. And what do you do? You will line up with these two. I come out here and ask you what you're thinking. You kick me square in the junk, and then you get your buddies to beat me up. So, Rocco, let's see if you've got any guts, if you've got any honor and any pride. Right here, right now, kick off Aftermath. The War Machine Sin against Rocco. And I bet you this, I bet you this, Rocco, you won't accept my challenge and send your two cronies to the back. You don't, you don't, you don't need to. You don't, you don't, you, don't, you, don't, you really don't. We're already better than here. Better than here. Hey, um, I know Rocco likes to say his name is Rocco, but I've got a different name for him, and I wonder if you guys could assist me uh, you got it. in a chant. You got it, you got oh. your match, you got oh. your match. I didn't have to resort to the chant, good times. Bye bye kings, queens, princesses, princesses, fairies. Your hair looks so Gino, your hair looks so sweet with it slicked back like that. It's so cute. I, I love I love that you cut your hair and he's checking me out! Yeah. So cute. Look at you with your slick back hair. Oh, it's so adorable. And look at Chris Shady in his red suit. That's so adorable. And look, I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna tackle you. You want the match you got? Yeah, Rocco, you got this in the back. Rocco's got this. Make sure you don't fall asleep. Don't fall asleep. You guys suck. Well, it looks like Aftermath is off to a roaring start here. We have Rocco versus the War Machine Sin. You know, it's not, I mean, in Aftermath, we definitely see a lot of things that we aren't used to calling or Thank what we you. thought we'd never say. I won't lie, this is something you might have thought you never hear. I'm a little speechless after this whole little debacle. Uh, hang on, I'm right in it. Wait a minute, wait, let me get my phone out. Hey, Mom, the yeah? The time Mom? is yeah? 2010. Mom, All right? yeah, Chad Epic is speechless. I know. I know, Everyone I'm amazed. Gets still hang on, we gotta call a match. Anyway, we are ready to roll here. Rocco, go and work on War Machine. Huh? Yeah, yeah, it'll tell her that, you know, you oh. were speechless. Tell her thanks for dinner the other night, by the way. It was very good. Oh, you were the lousy fuck she was talking about. Rocco now, working on Sin. And the war machine obviously having some words with the princesses. You, you really, you don't understand. They can hear everything you're saying. Let them hear what I can say. You know what? They talk about respect. They talk about, oh, we're so much better. They're so much better. You know what respect is? Respect is given. To get respect, you give respect. You're right. So give and, you know what? Respect to me go hand in hand. And the fact of the matter is, though, the fact is, those are three volatile, explosive people. If they... You really want to piss those guys off, Mr. Bishop? You know what? I don't I have care. made it a career of avoiding ass beatings. <laughs> a career out of it. <laughs> Hang on a second, Chaz. I'm, I'm recalling the ass beating you got by sin. So, you know, that's... No, that... Yeah, you're kind of... <laughs> the fact but is, no, that was a choice. And I actually gave it to him just as much as he gave it to me. And hold but, on. Speaking of ass beating, sin And the now. risk of actually them hearing this, they want to talk a lot about being... Founders, the guy doing the ring announcing yeah, you might tonight. Want to focus here no, Sin of is beating the beatings. hell out of people. Three Kings have a lot to go on. Hall of Famers, WAW champions, team champions. And you know what? There's yes. a WAW champion right there. There's You're a Hall right. of Fame right there who You're is right. currently putting Rocco up and on the, the tree of woe. And oh, talk about some serious wood incoming! Oh. Boom! The fact is, they're talking about how they look. You know, this, you know wait a minute. This yeah. is something German. Boom! Tossed him over like a pack of pumpkins. All right, well, they talk, the Three Kings talk about how they, uh, the, the reason WAW is around. The guy actually ring announcing tonight. Dirty Dealer is the reason they're around. Here, here we go. Oh, wait here a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, come on. Well, that's a uh, disqualification right there. Oh, give me a break. Oh. Winner of this match uh, by disqualification is uh, Sin. Whoa! Whoa, Major Morpheus Morensi. Oh, on a second. Sin wins the disqualification and unfortunately getting his ass beat. But here come Major Morpheus Morensi. Freaking flex, even up the score. The winner of this match he by tapped. disqualification, the War Machine Sin. No. Yeah! yeah. Hey. Well, that's what you get for you didn't the win. Guys. Look up, no. Mr. Wylacker. I'm Cassie. Do you have the brain cell between the three? No, you don't. No, they don't. I won. You know what? It doesn't matter. They made an impact. That's what matters. An impact. 
Mr. Wylacker is the winner of the match against the War Machine Sin. You are such a pussy, you know that? I don't like being punched in the face. Yeah, you're right, your face can't take it. But War Machine Sin does pick up the official win, and this aftermath is off with a bang! I was messed up, man. I don't know what's up, Three Kings. That match was supposed, supposed to happen. All right. I don't know. Hopefully, we'll get to hear from Buckle later. But the night's going to go on. We're going to do some team matches right now. A team match, baby. Let's bring out Miss Delilah Hayden and Miss Serena Merrick. Woo! Well, we got a Vitzings team match. Bianca, up to about five seconds ago, didn't have a partner. Yeah, and then she drags Selena, whose heart is broken, who is in no shape to be going into this kind of match. Hey, where's that violin you had earlier? You're a heartless man, Chaz. You really are. But you know what? I know something that's going to perk you right up. Hey, look, Chaz. Booby. What the hell is your problem? Stand up when you talk to me. You stand up when you talk to a champion. Stand up! You think I got this belt by sulking? By sitting around? Crying over Rocco? Where, where, where? I'm defending this belt next week. You better be ready. You know the thing? I can help you. I can seriously help you by teaming up and taking some ass against the island Serena. Come on. You're a vixen. Let's do this. Cry the bitch. Let's go. So down to keep, get all your energy out before the match stop. Take a five hour energy. I bet better just be five hour energy, may not be that power stuff. Anyway, their opponents in this team match. Let's bring out Divas Champ Bianca Wild and Salim. Oh, I can't help but one I'm thinking at this point. Whoa! Selena does not look like her heart's in it. And Bianca, of course, her usual congenial self. She has stated that the next week at the anniversary show will be the last time she defends the Vixen's Championship. In the final, uh, what, the final cat fight, if you will. Any Vixen in the WAW history can come in uh, and, and wrestle for the Vixen's Championship. And you know what? That's asking for trouble, if you ask me. I well, mean, you think about that, Katie Doobie. All right, Empress. Empress. Okay, Skit, even Laura Harris. You know, I Anyone? mean, how many Vixen? Kristen Sky. Beefy. B Does Beefy technically count? I think so. Okay. Well, whoa, Chill. hello. Match off to a roaring start Luke here Bez. with Delilah. Choking a bitch right there. Delilah still not happy. And Bianca tagging in Stalina. And Selena. Dylan needs to calm down. He's getting way too excited about this match. Stop it! Calm A little bit. All right, and here we go. I don't know what Stalina's going to Well, these two have actually have a lot in common if you think about it. Well, wait a minute. Hold on. It actually looks like... Oh, She's sympathizing oh, with her. Oh, come on. Think about it. Think yeah. about it. Michael well, James dumped uh, Delilah yeah. last year. Rocco dumped Stalina. Well, no. This is Mori Povich now. It's just Raga, yeah. yeah it's you know? Mori Povich right there. Well, no, I mean, Stalina's had her heart broken and... and well, Serena, Serena, well, Serena well, wants to wrestle. And oh, well, there goes Stalina. Well, Stalina, again, her heart not in it and doesn't want to fight. I mean, she's had her heart broken. What do you want from her? Well, she's asking us. And look at that. Now, this is respect. Stalina, Serena was holding her hand out, so trying to help her out, and Bianca now getting in the blind tag. Well, so, you know, oh, it's boy. a wrestling match. Serena just wanted to get pinned. I mean, ridiculous. I mean, isn't oh. that what got her into this problem in the first place? No, it was getting turned on by Rocco. That's what got her into this. And now Serena going in. Ducks the clothesline. Bianca off, off the, ropes. the ropes again. Impact coming and in. Over. And wait a minute. Oh, kitchen sink. Oh, of course Serena does a kitchen feeling. sink. If anyone knows something about the kitchen, it's a woman. Uh, Chad. Just saying. Two count. Bianca manages to get out there. And Delilah crawling around, going around the other side of the ring. And yeah, yeah, here you go. Yeah, here you go. Wait a minute. And ro rolling up Bianca too. No. Oh. That was a tag, yeah. so technically the pin doesn't work. Is that it? 
Oh. All right, well, there you go. Now, Selena. Match, baby. Serena Merrick. Delilah Hayden and Serena Merrick. Now, Selena manages to pick up the win while Selena was, uh, Selena, Serena. Why did the name look so much? So there's so much the same. Selena just walking out on the mat. You know what? She walked out on RIV. She walked out on Bianca Wild. No wonder Rocco friggin' left her. She, he dumped her before she could do it to him. Well, that yeah, was, uh, you have a very interesting perspective on history. But regardless, Selena, Serena, and Bi I mean, Salila pick up the win. And uh, the Vixen champion, as usual, looks like she needs a Midol. 